Yeah, raising money for Sebastian. Great cause. Yeah, I think it's a great cause. Um, he's only a little fellow, looks really sweet, and obviously him and the family must be going through a lot of stress and strain and heartache. So um, any little we can do to help out. Um, he's um, his relations training in the gym with Paddy, so I see his uncle from time to time and said to Paddy, anything I can do, uh, I'd love to help out. And um, I'm, I haven't really done much, you know. Paddy, Paddy's put, this, put, put the event together. Looks like he's got a great crowd together. So um, it's great to come down and be a part of it. It's, it's much more rewarding for me to, to meet, meet the guys and help individuals rather than massive corporations. So um, this is a, it's not a charity. This is, this is looking after your, 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 your extended family almost because it's like a really fam, family feel down at Paddy's gym and you know, they all look after each other. And now I'm in the gym, I want to do the same. So the timetable for the fight, the buzz is starting to maybe end of May, a couple of months away, but really, how, how does that work for you? Is it the last six weeks, is it the last eight weeks where you really start ramping it up? Yeah, pretty much. You know, um, Don't take me long to get fit. I'm in the gym just sharpening the tools, working the basics, getting the rhythm down, um, getting my eye in, trimming the fat, all the boring stuff. Um, and then yeah, we'll, we'll start really pressing home about six weeks out. And next week there's the big announcement of course so you're going to be super busy next week yeah next week all the all the media circus will start so they're going to announce the venue on tuesday um that'll be live on sky uh i look forward to finding out where i'll be boxing so um yeah the tickets go on sale the following week it will be probably sixty thousand plus and um with a bit of luck for me it, all, it, it sells and everyone has a good night. And you're going to be spending a lot of time in Swindon over the next 10 weeks? Yeah, I'm down here every week. We do a bits and pieces. We train from London and in Swindon. Um, it's nice down here. It's not far. I live close to the M4, so we fly down, especially on a nice sunny day like this. Uh, it's no bother at all. So uh, Paddy's got a really cool gym. It's, uh, it's a good vibe in there. Um, not just the reggae music. And um, it's, it's, it's a nice place to be. It's, uh, it's uh, George's biggest fight. It is a big fight, but I can't emotionally get involved in the fight itself. I'm training a, a guy, preparing a guy to, to engage with another man in a fight. We're two months, three months away from the fight now. What's the sort of timetable for training here in Swindon and London? Uh, well, we share the time between there and here. He comes down, I go up. We've been preparing for this since a week after the last fight. Uh, we got back into the gym before Christmas for a few weeks, and we had a week off for Christmas, done another week, and we had to go to America for the appeal. But since we come back, we've been training and preparing. And uh, as for how we step it up, we'll just gradually build it uh, and to be ready by the fight date. But it's just nice and casual right now. We're just going over reiterating things we need to work on. I believe my guy is going to win. We haven't done it yet. We can't hang our hat in the last fight and say, look how well we did. Because... We still didn't win the last one. So we got to come more correct. we got to come better prepared. But yeah, as far as confidence going into it, we were fully confident going into the first one, believing we could win it. We are fully confident going into this one, now knowing we can win it, knowing what George is capable of doing, knowing how he negates what Carl can do. So yeah, we're just confident of the win, but now we got to come do it. And it's going to be the biggest fight in boxing, British boxing history? Apparently so, and that's a good, that's a good thing. It's good for boxing. Boxing's on the up, so it's nice to have fights like this in Britain, yeah.